We will disassemble the motherboard with a known good CPU. Clean off the side sticker. Use a pair of tweezers and a hot air gun to disassemble two capacitors near the CPU. Please note, these capacitors need to be soldered back. Heat up the CPU. Insert the pry knife to the place with two capacitors pre-removed. Then pry up the CPU. Desolder the motherboard CPU solder pads with the soldering iron. Desolder the motherboard CPU solder pads with the solder wick. Clean off the motherboard, check whether the solder and sticker on the motherboard CPU solder pads have been well cleaned. Solder the capacitors back. Connect to the DC power uply. Boot up the motherboard and measure whether the current is normal. Current showed normal. Secure the CPU on the holder fixture, then desolder the CPU. Clean off the black sticker on the CPU. Clean off with PCB cleaner, then check the result. Use the soldering iron to drag clean the CPU solder pads, then use the solder wick to finish desoldering. Clean off with PCB cleaner. Use the low temperature solder paste to reball the CPU. Add solder flux on the motherboard, align the reballed CPU. Solder the CPU. Boot up and test the motherboard after cooling down.
Oh, 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 oh,